So if you lie to me, we're going to believe me, we're going to deal with that. Okay. okay. So. But we didn't honestly still, I promise. Like, maybe I was moving too fast, like, but a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff was skin. Like, maybe one or two things wasn't paid for. I promise, like, I was drinking, so if anything, it wasn't skin, but I promise, like, a lot of stuff was paid for. I got food stamps. I don't got no reason to steal food. Okay. So, okay. You got a probation officer? Okay. And I ain't even want this to get involved. That's why I don't do nothing, like, intentionally. Because I already know, like, I'm on community control. I can't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? Um, I got food stamps. Like, I didn't do nothing intentionally. I'm on community control because, like, a substance thing. Because I had pills in the car. Okay, the first, my first charges wasn't because of me. But I'm going to take the blame just because. You know what I'm saying? Even though the first charges wasn't because of me, I'm, I'm already in court for it. Why not take the blame? What's up, guys? It's your boy once again with another episode of Foolery. All right, guys. So I want y'all to check this out. You know how we always see in these women telling guys they need to do this, do that. You brokies, you this, you dusties, and all this other stuff. This the reality what, what you getting it from. Here we got this IG model. Who just so happened to be on food stamps. Now, you will say that's not a big thing, but the thing is, you get busted in Walmart for stealing food. Ain't that some? So, I'm not going to tell you the whole thing. Y'all just hit that subscribe, like, and share, and definitely hit that notification bell to get the next video. So, no further ado, we're going to jump right in, and we're going to talk about this. From IG to food stamps. Let's get it. You get out. Okay, I was like, we just bumped together. No, I wasn't. I was shopping at another one. Okay, so was I. I don't have time to be digging with Trump over the. No, this is shot. No, I don't have. They got already got excuses. Do you have ID on you? Go ahead. Yeah, Are you with LP? Hmm? I don't have ID. Negative. Where's my baby? This is the shower. Thanks for trying to reach 311. Okay, who is that? We can leave the kids in the car. 313 O'Kello. Do we have anyone else on this 32 call? I don't need this. Yeah, if you can make contact Bro, with Lost we, we are 10, 12 groceries. times two. We didn't Stop talking! Okay, all, right. all that mouth, man. Listen, stop. Are you going to let us explain or are you going to okay, sit there and yell? All right. They called us and said you were shoplifting. Listen, stop saying how. I'm telling you what we're here for. Well, I don't care though. We didn't steal it. I was on the whole thing. I didn't need it. So, so how come? Bro, none of us stole anything, but we didn't though. We were still in the store shopping. Well, guess what? We're doing 75 on three. All right. Damn. Oh, that's paid for. It's receipts in the bag. Okay. You don't gotta look at us like we stealing, bro. That's creep. Don't do that, bro. It's not the stolen, though. It's creep. We just went right. to a store. Don't even Listen. look at us like we. Stealing. Now, that's the one thing. You know you done did something, but then you keep disrespecting the guy, calling him bro, creep, all this other crap. This might learn to articulate what you have to say. When you get caught, let's just do that. Start talking like you have some type of intelligence. All this street talk and name calling, that just makes it worse, people. Especially when you know what you was doing in there. So then you're going to try to, all this stuff, and you and your girl going at it because your girl know you in there doing something wrong. So she mad with you. Or maybe they just do this. 
You know what I mean? So I don't know. But I wouldn't be sitting there doing all that talking when I know I done did something. It makes no sense. But these the girls, guys, they call y'all dusties and brokies and all that other stuff. These the ones. So I'm going to tell you something. Kids, okay, love what? You, man. Okay. Stop. They don't say love you, man. Because they, they really tripping. Look, he even know he did it. What? Okay. Car full of kids. I, can't explain I did because I couldn't even get Listen a chance to Listen to me. I can't explain nothing, stuff to you if you right, keep we'll talking. All right, well, come on. All right? I'm not saying you stole anything right okay. now. Okay, thank you. What I'm telling you is... We got 620 in gold chips, <laughs> okay. like in food stamps, and no, I'm still going to puff and I mean, pay for stuff, so he... OP, OPD admin. OPD tack one. She should just remain silent. Because anything you say can and will be used against you. Shut your mouth. And y'all got all those kids with this kids all in the back seat. Okay, listen. 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 No, they didn't even give me a chance to. Actually, we're going to go in the store okay, and we didn't do anything. confirm that right we now. The yeah, kids popping out. No car seats. I did, but she they did didn't give me a chance. Listen, you guys need to relax because you're going to make it a whole lot worse. Okay, we are. Okay, Mom. On camera, he saw it. He just uh, but we're going to confirm just to make sure. 26. Just, just, no, you're not leaving. You're both being detained right now. <laughs> How do you think you're going to leave? You go. I just told you, they called us. All right. Just, just she ready to leave her. She so talking, can I leave? They called us because they said that she was stealing. Okay. I was stealing. Stop. Just stop. This is a time for listening. Okay. She weren't there. So right now we're investigating it. That gives us probable cause to detain everyone involved. Yes, that includes you, okay? Um, more importantly, your child, there's no car seat for him in this car. You have open bottles of alcohol in this car. Oh. So that's on you. Doesn't matter if it's old or not. If I have a pound of weed in the car and you can't go, oh, that was from last week, right? Correct? I don't get in trouble. Like, I don't... Well, you got to open alcohol in your car. Certain situation on yourself. So it would be best in your interest to just calm down, let us conduct our investigation. And see, and this is the thing, the courts would give these women the kids just by thinking that they're better parents. They're riding around in the car with no car seats, with open alcohol in the car, and you up in the store shoplifting. But the courts will tell you, well, we think the kids will be better off with the parent, with the mothers. So they'll give the kids to these young mothers. And the fathers had to deal with the aftermath of this. A word if DSS or uh, what is a child protective service going to come and take the kids away. This is a hot mess, man. But this is what we got every day out here, people. Yeah, well, you shouldn't be conducting this activity with your kids. I wasn't. I, don't, I was on. The You're not driving side. with the kid without a without a car seat. I was seat on without, the whole other side. You weren't driving with a kid with open bottles of alcohol in your car. Okay, I was on the whole other side. How are you? She didn't want to answer that. Driving? Your kids in the back seat, correct? Ma'am, we're talking about your vehicle. Operating a motor vehicle with alcohol in it and no child seat. That's what we're talking about. I'm, let us invent, do one investigation at a time, okay? Your actions dictate how we act. I mean, you literally put the kids through all this. That's what y'all don't understand when y'all getting arrested out here with your kids because something you did. You gotta yeah, understand. So I got $602 on my food stamp. I'm a little tipsy, but we got it on her food stamp. Like, I don't got nothing to steal. It was nothing cash. Love you. Listen to me. It was nothing Love cash. You. Governor okay. assistance, okay. IG you model. Got them kids Look Listen. at Look at They just come. You guys be yeah. sending money to these chicks. I was drinking, but at the end no, of the day, two, I was making sure. Bunch of kids. Black female, like a um, green tank top with like flower shorts. Well, the crazy thing she said they was drinking. Yeah, okay. We both was getting stuff. She was right there next to me. She even walked away, but she told me. Make sure you stand. I already know. 
we both skinning anything. Like, I don't mind skinning and stuff. It's free. It's $620. We both skinning and stuff. She just walked away before. And see, she keeps saying it's free food. It's not free food. It's taxpayers' food. Taxpayers are giving you money. I don't see nothing wrong with you. Why are you not? Why are you getting it anyway? But taxes are giving you free money so you will have food. It ain't free food because we paying for it. But you look like you can go get a job. If you can ride around drinking and shoplift, you can go get a job and support yourself. Government assistance, but they be on IG model. Shh, man, please. I don't know what's going to happen. We're here. Okay. At best, listen, just, you're not listening. I'm already open, baby, because I don't want to have to me if I'm a listen, baby. Listen, we will make this as painless as possible with you, okay? Now you're worrying about At your best, kid. you got a nice complaint against Walmart, okay? But let us do our job. Okay, that's okay. fine. Okay. So this officer is going to ask you some questions. Okay, right. and I already said it. All right, but he's going to read something. shut your mouth. He already read Oh, you asked you, didn't you? No, no, I was talking about her. All right. Okay. She's been lying. I already said it straight up like so what, it was all food stamps. It's all food stamps. I didn't steal anything. I didn't put nothing in my purse. It was, it was good. Like it's all food stamps. Like so who was, who was we was drinking a little bit, but we was both skinny. We was both. Yeah. Do you have an idea? Yeah. She just keeps saying it's food stamps. Right. It was food stamps. Okay. Well, we're supposed to both have. Yes. Um, we're supposed to both okay have. My that makes it worse, to be honest. No, no, no. Because you have food stamps. No, no, no. My... You have food stamps and you out here stealing food. What sense does that make? I mean, really, you got to be probably the dumbest chick walking around right now. You saying you got six hundred some dollars in food stamps, and you end up stealing food. What? And Walmart has the most cameras that any any department store, grocery store in the United States. They got cameras. They got probably three cameras over each register. Everybody with common sense know Walmart has the crazy cameras. But y'all still going in still. I don't get it. I don't get it. Yeah, that's why all I care about. Oh, there come my brother. My brother picked my babies up. Tracy and her one here. Where's your brother? That's my brother right there. Right there with the... Come here, Brandon. No, he, he can stay there. Yeah. Hey, stay there. You can stay, stay there. Over there. Just stay over there for now. What? Just get down now, if anything, but stand by your car. Is your kid to work? I mean, can your kid walk her? Yeah, she's going to walk her. You want to walk her a little bit? But it wasn't, yeah, I love she's going to go there. But we wasn't trying to sell. We was literally paying for the food. Like, it was, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was just, yeah. But I didn't, like, I'm a little tipsy, but, like, I told, we was skinning and stuff. Even Why are you tipsy that was this early in the day? Was for stuff. Even she came up there and there with me. 23. Yeah, Do you have the receipt for everything? No. They left everything. Out. I gave it in the cart. Uh, so. I just don't. I'm already on community control. Uh, and I just don't so want to violate. I know the answer. Okay. And it is because now, this crazy thing. She's on community service already for something she's already done. Why you can't just do right? You're only 23. And you just turned 23. And you on community service, and now you get caught shoplifting. So I wonder if they would take the food stamps from her since she's in there with food stamps and stealing. Because mm. I know the answer. But it's my way of judging if you're going to be honest with me or not. Okay? So if you're honest with me 100%, we'll work with it. But if you lie to me, no, no, you you go absolutely. Go. Come on. So if you lie to me, we're going to believe me. We're going to deal with that. Okay. okay. So. But we didn't honestly still, I promise. Like maybe I was moving too fast. Like, but a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff was skin. Like maybe one or two things wasn't paid for. 
I promise, like, I was drinking, so if anything, it wasn't scant, but I promise, like, a lot of stuff was paid for. I got food stamps. I don't got no reason to steal food. I don't want my baby to see me get arrested. Like, yeah, I was drinking, but I promise I wasn't trying to steal food. Like, I got no reason to steal food. Hey, go. Have a nice day. Like, I got no reason to steal food. I just don't. Have a good day. I already got enough of stuff going on. I've been doing so good. But I just don't got no reason to steal food. Like, if I gotta go, I'm gonna go. Okay. Just cuz. Like, I'm gonna go. Cuz I ain't got no choice. But. So, you were scanning the items. Are you, are you claiming. Are you claiming you were just drunk and that's why you didn't scan all the items? No, I said I was drunk. Or did you a honestly bit, just? But we was both. Was listen, there, were you, you can to check. Just, it's most of. I got six hundred dollars on food stamps. I know, but listen. I, I get it. We was together. Like I, know, listen, I thought listen, I skipped most. Listen, 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 I listen, think listen. I did. You know, they shouldn't that, be, that, but one or two. Sorry. That's what alcohol do to you, people. Right. When you high and drink. Did you intentionally <laughs> miss scan <laughs> items? To no, I didn't. Did she? Did she? No, she was with me. She was just telling me, come on, like, come on. And I'm like, I'm coming. Like, I was trying to hurry up, but I don't think no item was in the skin. Maybe one, if anything, if it is stolen. So, why did you run out of the store? What's all we didn't. I walked back to the you register. Left you left all look. your stuff in there that you purchased. No, I didn't. You left $214 they were trying to argue. No, I didn't. Groceries. You can look at the register. I walked back over there with the people. I walked back with them, and then she was telling me, come on, come on. I'm saying, no, stay with me. Like, what you what you running up for? Like, I'm telling her straight up, no. Okay, so, so Wait, the if you look, I'm telling them, like, no. What you leaving for? Like, I don't know what you leaving for, but, like, what we stand for. So the video shows. I'm good. Yes, the video shows me telling her, why you looking? Like, let's talk to them. She need to shut up. Everything up. Okay. We, and, then we we me. and then you running out the door, leaving all your stuff. You got two hundred fourteen dollars in groceries. Oh, I didn't there. just leave. I was even talking to the people when we walked Did over you, there. Do you have all your groceries in your car? No, but that's okay. because she Why? left. But I was even telling. She she can't. If she shut up, she got to understand what he's saying. They tried to run out the store once they got caught, and she left. She already had scanned two hundred fourteen dollars worth of food, so that's what he's saying. If you was on the right, then why did you leave the food that you say you scanned properly? And she talked, why I didn't? He said, you left $214 worth of food back at the register. So she had already scanned over $200 worth of stuff. But your partner know your ass was about to go to jail. So she like, let's get out of here. Let's go. And now you got caught out here. Like... Man, y'all women ain't gonna get enough of this shoplifter. I know, but listen, why? If you look on the camera, bro, because they was arguing with me and she was arguing with me. Yeah, that bro. Here's my thing. If I'm going, I listen, told them. If I'm going but if you grocery, look, I told them. Lovey, this is your last chance to stop interrupting me. Because we're in very thin with you. I'll take it. She can't no. shut up. I know you will. But what I'm saying is if I go grocery shopping and I didn't steal, I'm not leaving two hundred and fourteen dollars. But that's what I was telling the people. And finish. Y'all not letting me say it, but I told them. Because it's not the time to say. It's not the time to say. I told them straight up. What are y'all saying? I told them that it's okay. It's funny how they can cry after they get caught breaking the law. It's funny. You upset that you got caught breaking the doggone law. That's like, come on, man. Now you just boo-hooing over here. You went in the store intoxicated. But I don't know what you was in there doing, but you get caught. And now you're out here crying. And you better be glad they ain't taking your kids from you. Sudden straight up. Yep. With my baby crying, running out the door with her. They kept trying to leave me. I wasn't trying to leave out the store. Will you call Officer Williams and see what he's got? I wasn't Ronnie trying Williams. to leave the store. I wasn't. Call him on the cell phone. I was the only one not trying to leave the store. How much you had to drink? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, go step over there. Go. It's not even about that. It's just it my is. baby. It is. How much you had to drink? Not that much. What's not that much? Huh? What's not that much? Like, a little bit like this much. We both had shots. 
Why would you go You're doing do shots, shots and go the first shot with kids in the car? Because she was the driver. But she had a shot. She had shots with me. But you know, Look how she snitched on her partner. She said that to my, she has shots. She does not want her to go to jail without her. I've been paying attention to her. She keep trying to put her in it. And the girl trying to get herself out of it. She's like, I was nowhere near her when she's doing it. But she keeps saying, she was there with me. And now she's saying, she was drinking with her and got in the car and drove over there, basically under the influence, with kids in the backseat. Like, the father should be coming to take these kids away, man. You see all this being irresponsible? Yeah, but Listen, like... you're very young. I know. So. I know. Where do you live at? In Hickory North. Hickory North? And that's another reason that I don't drink and come out. Don't drink and go out with her. Don't drink and go out with her. Because I don't drink and go out with her. Because just because, like, I've been home right, for so long, like two years. She trying to like, blame it on her? Good. I'm almost done with community control. What, what's your community control for? I'm coming up to what's my community not for this? It's for driving without a, um, driving with a suspended license. That's why I won't drive. Driving with a suspended license. Hey, just hang tight. Driving with a suspended license. Um, um, before like that, I was on um, like taking pills and stuff. Like before yeah. I got was taking pills, it was substance abuse because I had a methadone inside the car and stuff. Oh. But it's nothing like major, like. No, nah, it is major. Officer Elwer, can you kill your lights? Yeah. Seconds. Uh oh, here come the street lawyer. Here come one of the family members. Where's she at? Yeah, I'll be back out because I've been stopped. Okay. Now she come out and threaten the girl to my got my sister in trouble. Right here. So I guess the sister told her she done did something, but she come out here now she want to be Billy Badass. Your sister's a grown woman. Nobody got her in trouble. Because she jumped in that car after she'd been drinking and had her little kid, like he about three or, three or four, in the car, no car seat. A couple other kids in there, no car seats. So, but, you know, they got the family member that always want to be the street lawyer that comes out. Got to ask everybody, get bow up at everybody. Ma'am, you can leave right now. Right no, that's not sorry. Leave now. I'm getting the kids. Get them and go. You don't come over here and threaten somebody in front of me. Okay, what's his name? My name is Officer Coughlin. So you're not going to come over here and threaten somebody. You can go over there and leave now. You're going to leave now or you're going to go to jail for obstruction. You're going to leave now. You're going to leave now. It's Officer Coughlin. Congratulations. <laughs> hey, y'all need to give that up. We all talking about uh, with a people. I work for the government or I work for the county. You're not a police officer. It don't matter. It doesn't matter. You be a clerk at the county talking about I work for that county. And somebody love to I work for the government. Shit, I worked for the government for over thirty years. I wasn't no police officer doing it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Uh -huh. Listen, I get it, but you, you're headed down a bad path. Okay. And the cop, he really don't okay. want to arrest her, but he got to. He going to have to. So I want to try to get my yards. I got my kids. I don't, I don't get in trouble. I don't do that. Listen, I get it, but look what you're doing. Look at the attention you're bringing on yourself. I'm not. I'm okay, not. listen. Listen to me. I just have to Just, listen, just listen to me. Now that you're calm, right? Yeah. You call your sister over here. To get the kids. But what did she do? She threatened someone in front of a police officer. Her jail right there in there. All right. So you're driving around with kids. I should call DCF because you're driving around with open liquor in your car. That's what I should do. Please don't. Please. Well, like I said, your actions dictate everything, and her actions are going to dictate things. Tracy, hush, please. No. I've been caught on a phone. She has. So. We're going to finish what we're doing, yeah. and if we find out you're not involved, 
then we'll see how it goes. Maybe I write you a citation for the open containers and a court date. Maybe I call DCF. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. But your actions dictates this, this investigation. Got it? Yeah. Okay. What do you say? Sorry. So, I'm good with not doing that, though. Huh? Oh, so right now we have uh, $164. Okay, now they're gonna do surveillance. Look, look at the camera side looking at her. Right there, that red. Right there's her. Tell you, Walmart got the cameras, man. Camera. You're gonna have to let us know when something's not scanned. Okay, so that was the first time she didn't scan something. Right, it was the very first time. What were those pork chops or something? She paid for two of the same pork chops. None of them were the same. Put his big back in the way. Scanned the same one multiple times. They were all different weights. Um. And she bagged, she only scanned it twice even and put four of them in the bag. Wow. Here she has three of those in her hand, scans it twice and bags all three. Zero five. You can go ahead and get Can you go back? I don't, I don't know this one. Okay, so what she's doing, let's say you got uh three packs of hamburger. Or say steaks, three packs of steaks. And each steak has a different amount because it weighs more or less. She's taking the less amount one, holding the other in, other three in her hand, and scanning that less one three times, and then dropping up, dropping them all in the bag. So it's gonna show like she has twenty three items. It's gonna show twenty three items, but it's gonna have multiple items scanned under the same price. So that's what she's doing. And that's what he can see that she's doing. Like she's holding it in one hand and scanning it three times and then throwing it in the bag. I'm telling you, man, people get, they smart about stealing, but they, they won't get a job. They waste all that talent trying to get over. Yeah. Sorry? You go back should to be that? kicked off the government system for this. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. So there's two in that and one in the other. Yes, correct. Let's see what he's saying. Let's see if that hurts. Perform tight. Tight. That view's fine. Okay. Yeah, that. Yeah, if I saw. Yeah, we saw the other one doing, like, trying to reach in and scan, too. She wasn't even doing it slick. Uh, she stole several of these, but the only, the, the, I didn't determine which one she stole because they're all the same price. So I just separated out 10. That's how many she paid for. And, yeah. So when, so, you, go, when you go to the grocery store, right? Like, I promise. You look, okay. at, you look at the steaks or you look at chicken, mm -hmm. you might pick up a pack of steak, it's $11. You might pick up an identical pack and it's $13. You know why? Or do you assume everything in that shelf is eleven dollars? It's eleven dollars if it's no, if it's meat and it's the same pack, then yeah, it's eleven dollars if it's the same pack of meat. But then if it's the steak and it's two steaks, then it's usually like thirteen dollars, twelve dollars. But yeah. that whole but I didn't that whole steal case right there. Listen, that whole case right there, right? The meat's all different prices because like she's it's realized price by now. Pound, correct? You buy look meat. at her mouth. Yeah. No, <laughs> if it's the size, then it's eleven dollars for um the hamburger meat. It's usually like ten dollars, eleven dollars for the hamburger off meat. A pound. So however much that, if a pound of steak. Yeah, I did. Okay. Okay. So okay. So Maybe you, I did. How would you ring? How would you ring them up? Okay. So if she should know right now. They the know. The meat is the same pack. I, I if it's the same know. pack of meat. You rank it up like one, two, three. Yeah. That's the same pack because you're okay. But so no. okay. you got a You're not that dumb. Okay. And I ain't even want this to get involved. That's why I don't do nothing like intentionally. Cause I already know like I'm on community control. I can't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? Um, I got food stamps. Like I didn't do nothing intentionally. I'm on community control because it's like a substance thing. Cause I had pills in the car. Okay, the first, my first charges wasn't because of me, but I'm gonna take the blame just cause, you know what I'm saying? Even though the first charges wasn't because of me, I'm, I'm already in. What is she talking about?
why are you talking about some first lady? Why are you talking about something that's already happened? They're talking about what's going on now. You could tell like she's so scared and nervous. She's just rambling now. But see, the thing, when you start rambling, you start telling on yourself. So that's why I said she need to just shut her mouth and just sit there. Because once they start talking about how they were scanning that food, she should have realized she was caught. And that's when you just don't say nothing. Why not take the blame? The driver, you gonna tell? I still went ahead and took the blame. Like I don't do nothing intentionally. Yeah, be honest with me. You knew you were not ringing up everything correctly. No, I didn't. I was ringing up threes, two. This is what you took. I was ringing up. I got two pies in my hand and one pie in his hand, and you go one, one two, three, and oh. put in three, and then you got five packs of steaks, and you go one, two, three, three four. Oh. And put five in there. You're 22 years old. You're not seven. You know. Right. You know that meat is a five pound, and you know every time you look at the meat because you look at the meat because you determine if it's a good piece of meat. Are you going to buy a moldy blue piece of meat? So that means you look at it, correct? <laughs> okay. So that means you look at it and you see the price. Oh my God. With everything going on these days, you are more con you are more conscious. Stop. You are more conscious of the price of things. I guarantee it. I guarantee you are more conscious of the way you purchase. So don't lie to me. Just say, look, I was trying to save a few bucks in, no, in pay. Food it doesn't matter. It matters. Know, Still. I promise. Like, maybe I was moving fast. Why don't you just say, keep excusing it because it's food stamps? Oh, oh yeah. She don't go to jail. I didn't scan it. Like you're the only one on video, lovely. Yeah. Now listen. She never physically wrong anything. But she was. We can put you in handcuffs now. Or you... That is crazy. She want her to go to jail with her. See, I keep telling y'all, people do not want to do that crime by themselves. They don't. They want you to go to jail with them. People always want you to go somewhere with them when they're going to steal something. Hey, man, come on. Let's go with me. I'm going to get this stuff, man. I just need you to look out for me. Come on, man. Go with me. I'm, I'm going to do this right here, man. Just, I need something. They always do. And they don't want to do this time by themselves. So that's why she keep telling this girl, telling them why she's not going to jail with me. I don't know if they're friends or what. So it definitely don't seem like they're friends. The sister come out and blame her for getting her sister in trouble. Now, the sister probably telling you shouldn't be hanging out with her. She ain't nothing but problems. You can walk over there like he suggested because you know, he's trying to give you a courtesy. I just want to tell my mama real quick, please. And we'll bring her to you. We'll bring her to the vehicle. You got about She's two not here. Can you call her real quick? Look no, at you this. can call her at the jail. You got two seconds before he snatches you up. <laughs> Oh, that's it on this, man. You see this mess? They want to act like kids when they do something. I call my mom. Mama is not coming out here to the arresting site. That's like people talking about, I call my lawyer. You don't send your lawyer out to the arresting site. The lawyer's got to come get you out of jail. They can't show up out there while you're getting arrested and I'm a lawyer. You need to speak with me. No, we're going to arrest them. And then you come down to the jail and get them out. And then you can start doing all your work. But they just keep thinking, and then <laughs> I'm surprised she said, y'all didn't speak to my lawyer. I'm going to call my lawyer. I'm surprised she didn't do that. But the fact that you are in here with over $600 worth of food stamps and you are stealing the food, why? Like you say, it's free money. So why are you stealing? You should just, because every month they're going to give you 600 more. I wish we could get some mess like that. This is what I don't like about all this stuff now. They giving all this free stuff to people, and this is what they do. Now, the hardworking people, now we don't get this. I can't remember last time I went and got 200 some dollars worth of groceries. Not in one setting. Maybe in twice, three times out of a month, I might end up over 200 because go buy 100 some dollars. But 200 some dollars in one setting, I can't remember last time we did that. It's crazy, man. 
They got these kids on these, these, not kids, but these women on these programs, and they don't work. They just collect, just get in trouble, get high. You drinking in the middle of the day, midday or little afternoon, y'all taking shots. What, about 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon? Because it started getting dark, so I'm going to say about 4 o'clock in the afternoon, 3 or 4 in the afternoon. I don't get it. I just don't get it. But this is where we at with this, and y'all just keep, the you know, the governments keep giving all this free money to these people because they have kids and not evaluating why they can't get a job in a certain amount of time. Why aren't they working this stuff off? I understand everybody need help. I know all the women are like, well, you never know. You this and this. I guarantee you they cut this shit off, y'all start working. I guarantee you that. I guarantee you all these kids will stop getting born out of wedlock. I bet you that. Because y'all know, you keep having kids, you can stay in the system a little longer. But the wrong person get in that office, y'all going to see some changes. I tell you. Well, guys, what y'all let me, <laughs> guys, y'all let me know what y'all think about all this. Uh, hit me in the comments. Don't forget to hit that subscribe, like, and share. And I'm going to get up out of here. And remember, all you people on food stamp, stop stealing food. They already gave you the money. And it's your boy. I'm up out of here. Peace. Thieves.